President Ma Ying-jeou traveled to Singapore today to pay respects to Singapore's founder, Lee Kuan Yew. It marked the first ever visit by a directly elected president of Taiwan to a country that has diplomatic ties with China, although the low-key nature of the visit was criticized by opposition lawmakers. President Ma was accompanied by a large entourage as he made an unannounced visit to Singapore to pay respects to the late Lee Kuan Yew. Ma refused to answer questions about why his trip was so secretive or why he had requested a plane earlier that morning on short notice. In fact, the presidential office continued to deny reports of a foreign trip even as Ma was traveling to the airport. Ma Zhou is being way too low-key, which is denying the people of Taiwan the right to information. I think that this is going too far. Premier Mao Zedong said Singapore specifically asked Taiwan to be low-key. Former senior foreign ministry officials believe the lack of official diplomatic relations between Taiwan and Singapore, along with pressure from China, were behind the manner in which Ma's trip was arranged. There is no perfect arrangement, but I think everyone's concerns were addressed. China's Taiwan Affairs Office made a statement today saying that the late Li Guanyao had supported the One China policy. It called upon all sides to reaffirm this principle when expressing condolences.